welcome back sorry i haven't posted in a bit um this video is concerning um young jugglers there's a group of young jugglers we're all kind of in cahoots on youtube so if you're one of my normal viewers you can watch this if you're another young juggler that wants to compete you also should watch this uh, you should also subscribe if you're not helps the channel anyways i am hosting a juggling competition these are the rules available moves with three balls mills mess equals 0.5 points the shower pattern with three balls equals 0.5 points a one ball 360 a three ball one up 360 equals 1.5 points two up 360 with three balls equals two points three up 360 with three balls equals 3.5 points back crosses on one side this means half of the pattern is normal and half of the pattern is a back cross so I'm throwing normal throws in front of me with my left hand and I'm throwing back crosses with my right that's one half back crosses that move equals 3.5 points continuous back crosses throwing back crosses from both sides equals 5 points the cascade equals 0.5 points all moves must be qualified four ball moves the synchronous fountain the balls are being thrown at the same time so two two this equals 3.5 points the async fountain equals 3.5 points the shower pattern with four balls equals four points three up behind the back equals four points I know some of you may not know what a three up behind the back is, so I will show in this video in the bottom right corner. Okay, a four up 360 equals five points. Wimpy equals three points. The half shower equals three points. All moves must be qualified. Five ball moves. Cascade equals four points. The reverse cascade equals five points. Half shower equals 4.5 points. Tennis equals five points. Five ball, three up 360 equals 5.5 points. Five up 360 equals seven points. Five ball gatoplex equals 5.5 points. Sex X4 equals six points. Six ball moves. Six ball async fountain equals six points. Six ball sink fountain equals six points. Wimpy equals 5.5 points. Half shower equals six points. Six up 360 equals eight points. All moves must be qualified. That goes for the five ball moves too because I didn't say it back there. Now, this is the final level of available points. Seven ball cascade equals 7.5 points. Seven ball half shower equals eight points. Seven ball five up 360 equals nine points. And to collect. This, mean, this means that if you throw all five balls up in a seven ball five up 360 and you just collect them, like you just catch them all, you don't continue the pattern, you get nine points you will get nine points if you continue in the pattern too. Seven up 360, 10 points, and two collect. This still means if you catch all seven after you do the pirouette, you will still get 10 points. The seven up 360 is the highest scoring move in the competition. Additional thoughts. If you have any questions about the scoring or about any tricks, please feel free to comment them down below. The comment section will be open. And uh, good luck to you all. I'm going to say that submissions will be due by the end of June. 
So let's do June 30th is the last day anyone will be allowed to submit a form. After that, you can't submit your video. And if you do, it just won't be counted as part of the competition. Good luck to you all. Make sure you tag me in your video so I know and I can find it. Uh, also, in the comment section of this video, if you're entering, tell me when you've uploaded it so I can go look at it. Good luck.